hello you guys so I have a fun video for you guys today where we've unboxed lol the dance dance omg doll and um it's miss b girl she was on clearance when I went to walmart I looked at royal b neon licious there were a few that I really liked but because this one was on clearance I went with her they had um, Miss Royal there when I went. Um, I don't remember if they had Major Lady, and I don't believe they had Virtuelle. But the box is made to look kind of like a VHS, where it's got like a TV guide on the back that says, OMG, we sisters are ready to groove, yes. Remix your moves, dance off, fierce style, dancing with the BBs. Extra like OMG and dance your heart out. And on the inside, when I unboxed her, because I've got her out ready to show you guys, I was such a fan of the box and the design with the windows where it says star over there. And it was easy to like slide into the little VHS looking case that I'm keeping the box for once. Um, I don't always keep the boxes, but that one I think is nice, and I might see if we can make some little miniature dollhouse furniture and kind of set it up and make it look like a room and reuse some of it because <laughs> I've been wanting to get into making some dollhouse miniatures. So we might do that here on the channel. So our doll came with, as usual, this little dance guide. I put these in my dollhouse as little magazines for the dolls to read. Um, it comes with this. And it came with a pair of adorable sunglasses that I've got on the doll. And then it came with this little LED light or little battery, like you push the top and it's this little light. It is super cute. Um, I'm going to put it in my dollhouse as a lamp for my dolls on like one of the, I don't know, somewhere is in it. I think it's cute. So here is our doll herself. Now there's an LOL tween and she has braids like this. And I will, I don't remember which one it is. I'm going to like see if I can find her for a minute. I believe it was, doo -doo 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 -doo, I'm pulling it up, Freshest. Her hair reminds me of Freshest, only Freshest has like a brown and kind of blue mix. Whereas she has a black and gray mix and I'm honestly in love with her hair. She even has the baby hairs painted on her face. She has these brown eyes with some gray eyeshadow and some like red purple lips. Kind of these, these dark purple lips. And then she's got like a white stripe painted on her face. This what well, looks to me like a winter's jacket and it also feels kind of like the material you'd see in a winter jacket. Along the side she has strings that say LOL OMG as if that is the brand name. Her shirts are black and white and they say slay. Her top is this little crop top so I imagine she'd be cold in it. I'd need a winter jacket if I were a crop top. Um, but I live in Maine so it gets cold here. She's got this little like kind of gray stitching detail. I can't tell if it's even. I feel like her top looks like it's uneven to me. Um, I really like her shorts. I like the black, gray, and white color scheme she has, but it doesn't really like it's got like hints of neat like this bright hot pink, but it doesn't really scream kids colors to me. She's got these black and white socks with some white shoes that have some painted black stripes and some little white, I don't know, painted lace. It's made to look like it's got laces. Her glasses kind of have this angle to them and they're white and they're, they're adorable. Like overall, the look of the doll is just very like 
modern and hit and cool and I feel like she is slaying just like her shorts say. Love the baby hairs. I'm impressed. I'm not a big big a fan of the fabric of the shorts. Like it feels scratchy to me. Like I don't know. The, the fabric kind of doesn't feel like soft and cozy to me. But that's okay. It's a doll. She's, I like her brown eyes too and her skin color. Can we just take a moment and stop and appreciate that skin tone? Like it is gorgeous to me. I don't know. She has a really gorgeous skin tone with the hair and just, I feel like this doll is really, really nice. I don't know if she's my favorite out of all the LOLs. I've yet to pick a favorite because I haven't seen them all. But I have been watching some YouTube reviews on them myself and getting an idea for them. Eventually I want to get like Lady Diva, Royal Bee, Swag, and Neonlicia so I have like some of the four original girls. Because that'd be cool. I have like the original Rainbow High girls except for Amaya. Um, so I'd like to have the original LOL four main characters. I will say that after seeing her, I would really like them to make a Rainbow High with a similar color scheme to her and see what they could do with that on a Rainbow High doll because she is really pretty and her um, outfit feels modern and really nice. It's nice. Like it's modern, it's hip. I can't get on enough with the outfit because I think it's gorgeous. They, like, I like that the OMG dolls are really, like, over-the-top kind of fashions and all, they have their own style and I love the LOLs. And I like that Rainbow High is going in a, like, a very current fashion direction. Like, MGA really nails the fashions on their dolls. Um, Mattel does too, but they, I feel like they go classic, a more classic look, I guess where the rainbow highs are very current and the lols are very extra kind of current i i don't know like they're just over the top but i mean the lols really like sell their character to me um i feel like rainbow high also does as well but just in a, a different way than the lols to me i love both brands i love barbie as well um, I feel like we gotta appreciate the ones that came before MGA. Um, because I know Barbie's like dominated the doll market for a long time. Um, there are a lot of different doll brands I love and they're constantly coming out with more brands and more lines, which is great. Like, I feel like after Monster High ended, I was super into Monster High. And it felt like there was a while where I didn't really see a doll I wanted, even like a Barbie that I wanted. And I don't know why that was. None of them just stood out to me. And all of a sudden now there's like so many choices. Like there's LOLs, Rainbow Highs. I saw this like 18 inch doll in Target that was like Mickey Mouse themed that I, I wrote down on my birthday list because I collect the American Girl dolls. I've seen Barbies that I want lately with like that very over the top fashion. The Barbie extras and the Barbie extra minis and... I'm excited. I feel like there's a lot of good things going on in the doll community lately. As far as the doll brands that they have. And I'm excited to be collecting. So I would love to hear from you guys what your favorite LOLOMG character is. Um, what's your favorite doll? Um, what is your... Um, favorite kind of doll doll brand like I've had questions you guys and on an unrelated note one of the things that I really wanted to do on my channel was kind of bring you guys into the the video and I wanted to uh, essentially choose a comment from you guys uh, each video to kind of feature. So I'm gonna go on to my videos 
and I picked the comments. I'm just going to mute the video. Um, and let me make sure... Okay, we're just gonna do 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 do, and we're gonna scroll down, Miss Miss uh or, or Mister, I don't know which. We've got Blockberg fan. Thank you for your little Christmas tree Santa emojis. I appreciated it. I thought it was cool. Um, so yeah, if you guys want the chance to be kind of your comment to be featured in a video and me to go and look at it, please let me know and I will, um, I'll show off one of you guys's, um, comments and whatnot but thank you Blockberg for commenting that I loved seeing your Christmas tree emoji my mom was having fun showing me her Christmas decoration that's her favorite um it sings it's it's a cute little like emoji emoji Christmas decoration um mom had me laughing when she said that that's her her favorite um so yeah bye, -bye everyone I give this LOL a good review, except that her top look doesn't look like it's completely straight at the top. Other than that, the stitching on the jacket is very even, the pants, like I'm not seeing any loose threads. And I hope you guys are having a fabulous day. BB Girl says goodbye as well. Bye y'all.